But I deal now with the topic of how to make a lead with an F connector at each end of it. Um, this is an important task because it, it may often be necessary to extend an existing satellite cable uh, or to run off a, an F type wall plate, bring a, for example a satellite connection from um, the wall plate into the back of a satellite box. And um, to do this job we need uh, uh, just one tool, a set of snips, and in terms of equipment we're going to need um, two um, F-type connectors, which you can see here, and also a length or a roll of satellite cable, which we can cut to, cut to the required length. So the first step is to pick up the snips and to pair down the end of the satellite cable. We do this by about 20 millimeters from the end of the cable to make a series of circular cuts, and um, probably about four in total. And once we've done that right around the cable, we put in a series of about two or three cuts to get to the top of the cable. And now, just using our, our thumb, we can remove the outer uh, black cable. We push uh, the, the core cable that's made of copper braiding uh, down around the, F, uh, the, the black external section and wrap it in a clockwise direction. Now, our next obstacle that we must remove is the actual silver foil that's wrapped around uh, the satellite cable. Uh, this will be a hindrance to us as we try to put on our cable. So using a set of snips we cut off this foil. Um, the next step here is to use the snips again and about six to seven millimeters from where the copper braiding has been wrapped around the cable we make a total of normally three cuts in the white foam in the center of the cable. And uh, we twist it um, the end piece and it will simply break off instantly and now we have a pair down cable that's ready for the insertion of a, a, an F-type connector. So the F-connector comes along here, we twist it in a clockwise manner around the cable and we need, we need to insert it sufficiently onto the cable so the white foam is at the base of the F-type connector here and at this point here we pick up our snips and cut off the excess uh, centre copper core leaving it about I suppose one to two millimeters proud of the at top of the F-type connector. So at this stage, we've put successfully put on the F connector here. Uh, next, our next step is to cut the satellite cable to length. Normally, we will cut it um, for the purpose of connecting a satellite to a faceplate, uh, probably you know between 0.8 and 1.4 meters. In this case here, I've made the cable probably about 0.9 meters, and I've already put an F connector on the far end. So what we have here is a fully assembled uh, coax to coax, or F-type to F-type uh, cable uh, that's ready for use.